Lexi and Bangs, and it's Show Us Your Hometown Week, and we're in Bountiful, a place that a lot of you may know for cheesy salsa and chips. That warm salsa's good. They've already started feeding us, too, so I'm gonna go ahead and take a bite. We're at El Matador on Main Street in Bountiful. Let's see if these guys have the best tacos on the Wasatch Front. Hi, I am Cammie Johnson, and I am the general manager of El Matador Restaurant in Bountiful. This is my mom. My name is Rosemary Costradian, and this is a family-owned restaurant that we've been here since 1977, 44 years, and we love the community, and we're just here to serve them. So today we have come up with some fantastic tacos that our customers rave about. We have these sweet pork tacos that we cook six to eight hours. We have all natural ingredients, and then we shred it, and then we caramelize it on the grill and we make a special pineapple mango salsa to go on top of it and it's something that we came up with and we absolutely love it and our customers love it. And the other taco that we're gonna share today is called our Main Street Tacos because we are on here on Main Street and that's the name that my mom came up with. And it is a carne asada. Uh, we marinate it and we grill it and then we put charro beans, which is a bean that we cook here for hours with really good bacon and top it with crema. All of our sauces and all of our dressings, anything that we use here are all homemade and you have it one time and you keep coming back. Time to taste what we've got. What do you do? What is that? It's a sarsaparilla soda. What is a sarsaparilla? I don't know, but it comes from Jackson Hole, so I'm gonna drink it. All right. Uh, we've been given the Kraken to eat. We have sea monsters that we're gonna be battling today. Mm. Look at the size of this shrimp. Holy cow. Pork one first, Lex? I think the pork one first sounds great. You know, we always talk about it. Fresh lime, key sign, all right? Get her done. That mango salsa is excellent. There's the way that's crispy too. Oh my god. I think it's time maybe we do the next one, Banks. It's the carne asada. Guac is life, guys. Guac is life. Like if I was ever to get like a gangster tattoo like Tupac, I could get guac life across my stomach like that. It would be really cool. Give you should do that. Cred with that. The beans on that? Mm hmm How is that even? Because of bacon. That's so good. That's what it is, isn't it? It's delicious. That guac too, it's perfect. We have gargantuan fried shrimp. You guys talked a pretty mad game on the shrimp. This is gonna kind of be our little bonus round here. What else is he bringing? Are you serious? What is that? I think it might be dessert. Sopa dots, pure sugar and butter. Sopa dots, here little we go. Sopa pia dot. Fried dough with everything on it. Mm. Score it up, Lexi, out of five while I'll eat a shrimp. I feel like it deserves more than five out of five because everything was so delicious. So I'm gonna go with six out of five. I'm going with 15 out of five because these get five out of five and the shrimp get five out of five and the sopa dots get five out of five. Shut up, come and see our friends at El Matador, all right? We may have found the best tacos on the Wasatch Front. We are always on the hunt for the best tacos on the Wasatch Front and we wanna come to a spot near you. And if you have a place where you'd like us to try your tacos, just leave a message here or email Lexi at cable93.com.